Roxanne, today I am very proud and excited to make you my wife. <laughs> my forever partner in this journey called life. <laughs> Don't get excited, that's where the rhyming ends. <laughs> I love how your smile can brighten any room <laughs> and how your personality can befriend everybody around you. I also love your independence and self-assuredness, but at the same time, your ability to accept support and reassurance when needed. I love your family, all of them. I met Roxanne because I was a patient at her dental office and I was a patient for a few years actually and had never met her or seen her in the office. Uh, I happened to be getting a, a procedure done and she was the, the assistant helping me that day. It's kind of like random that we hadn't met before, but, um, but I met her at the office. I don't know what I was waiting for this time. Big heart, but he's just, he always thinks about everybody else, or he puts some, everybody else before himself. And he's always so supportive about anybody and everything. And he's just really thoughtful. Smoothie pie. I love what makes you you. How loving, caring, and patient you are. I love when you kiss me good morning before you leave for work and how you always kiss me good night. I love that you care about how I am deathly afraid of frogs and you will do frog check for me to make them all hop away so I don't have to see them. I love the big heart that you have, how you tuck each of our dogs into their beds and kiss them every night. I will continue singing silly songs and break out with crazy dances around the house and just hope that you dance and sing along with me. We've been hanging out quite a bit and you know a couple nights a week turned into several nights a week and I, I knew that that we were falling in love and, and I, I pretty much knew then it took a little while for me to ask her to marry me but um, but I did know she, she was the one pretty early on it's just really easy going she lights up a room when she walks in and she can befriend pretty much anybody that's in a room um, and, and that's really my favorite thing about her
I'm a little sunshine when the sun shines on the wrong day, and I believe my bed is a constant bearer of these sunshades. 'Cause I'm a little sunshine when the sunlight beckons. I wake up, oh, I won't wake up. You cannot say no. Today is the wedding of Brett and Rock. We all know that roses are so beautiful, but they also got thorns. This tells us that life can be interesting. Many obstacles may come. But even if obstacles come, we are sure that there will be clear days, happy days. But you know what? One thing is very, very sure. We got lots of friends. We might not have seen you in person all these years, but you were always there for my kids. From the bottom of my heart, I say thank you very much. Uh, I hope you will always be happy as you are today. Enjoy your life to the fullest, and always remember: never go to bed mad. Support your life goals and help you reach those goals any way I'm able. I promise to live life to the fullest with you, to have fun with you, laugh with you, and cry with you, <laughs> and love you with all my heart. I want to thank you. Thank you for accepting me, both positive traits and flaws. Thank you for loving me. Thank you for sharing the little canine family we have back in Texas. <laughs> With my whole heart, I take you as my husband, acknowledging our and accepting our faults and strengths, just like you do mine. With every beat of my heart, I will love you. I look forward to continuing our journey. Only now I can be proud to introduce you as my wife. Lovers. <laughs> I can't kiss you. Oh yeah. <laughs> I love you, sweetheart, and I will continue to love you the rest of our lives. Can you take a picture with that or no? Big old. Do you have a Mentos commercial now? <laughs> we all have the same color dress. Just Was that close to the like, like I was just doing some curls. <laughs> Introduce my family on my side. I don't know. If, I don't know if we have that much time. Cut my whole interview out. We don't have to put anything of mine up there. Hello. Hello. You don't want my chicken arm? No, I don't. I don't know what's happening. What are you most excited about? Um, I guess being Mrs. Skull. <laughs> <laughs>